Well, over the last few years, Riverfront Park has been undergoing a massive redevelopment, with one of the goals being to bring the pavilion back to life. On Friday, the city will host a grand opening of the pavilion free to the public. But this morning, our Caroline Flynn is live there with a sneak peek. It looks amazing from here. Oh my gosh, it is so amazing. And by the way, the celebrations will continue Saturday too. I've got John Moog with me this morning from Riverfront Park. And John, I don't know, I feel like you and I need to get off camera to show everyone what's behind us because this is unbelievable. Really, this is unbelievable. <laughs> this is Spokane's lantern, right? Here, so we'll this step off. 72 light Whoa. blades here and every foot of the blade is programmable so we have over 606 uh, 6,600 programmable feet of light here happening right now uh, so on this display we actually have uh, the summer program portion of the summer program so you see the lights transition through different effects here and this is one of many programs that we plan to show throughout the year we're not going to show everything just yet you're talking about these light shows the light shows right wow. so this is just one show that we have coming here we're going to start playing it right here at grand opening on this Friday so that's going to be cool. really cool to see uh, we'll also have some other special effects that we'll be showing on Friday so come down and see that uh, but most importantly this Pavilion, uh, the light show is part of the lantern that we wanted and we recognize in the master plan. We wanted the community to really see the pavilion for what it is and recognize and we have community events going on here. This is exactly uh, how you'd recognize it. This is so cool looking. I, I, we were just talking before we came on. I, I've never seen anything like this. And what I think is going to be so cool, real quick, John, is you guys are also going to be putting this to music too. We are going to program it to music. So we have a device that syncs music to the lights. Oh my uh, we, gosh. There is There is some DJ work that needs to happen <laughs> to make it work just perfectly, uh, but it will provide a real custom looking show and it will just be a fabulous experience. Oh my gosh. Well, this is so, so special. I think so many memories are going to be made here over the next years with your families. Make sure you come on down Friday and Saturday. We've got even more ahead previewing some of those events happening over the weekend in just a few minutes live from Front Park Caroline Flynn for News Now